I have a Samsung Galaxy Note 20 here. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos directly from your Note 20 to your Chromebook. Okay, now it's a little bit different. It's not like dragging and dropping like you do in a Windows computer. And I'm talking about saving the photos and videos actually on the Chromebook. I'm not talking about uploading it to Google Drive. Okay. So first thing is you need to go ahead and grab your charging cable. Now the thing is with the Note 20 here, your charging cable that you get is a USB-C to USB-C. But on my Chromebook here, I don't have a USB-C connector or a Thunderbolt like I do on my uh, Windows laptop. However, I do have a USB-A to a USB Type-C. Okay, so let me go ahead and plug one in into my USB port. And now let me grab my Note 20 here and we're going to pop this in. And we're going to see what happens. Okay, so let me go ahead and log in then. Right away, I get a message right here, allow access to phone data. Click on allow. If you don't get that message, unplug your USB, plug it back in or plug unplug, plug it here, okay? If you don't get that, there's something not uh, connecting correctly, okay? So as soon as I plug it in, I get this window here that pops up. Now, you, if you look on the left pane here, you should have something that says Galaxy Models right here, MTP, right here. So let me go ahead and double click on that. Now, let me go ahead and scroll down. Now, these are the files that I have on my Note 20. What you want to do is go to the DCIM, double click on that. And then right here, you can see I have two albums or two folders. I have one camera and one screenshot. So all my screenshots are in this folder. And all the photos that I've taken with my Note 20 and my videos that are recorded, is under here under camera. Now I only have two videos, MP4s, and I have one photo, a JPEG right there. Now if I want to save this to my Chromebook, a lot of you guys are probably like, for example, if I want to go ahead and move this uh, MP4, this video, you can't drag and drop it onto your desktop like you can with a Windows computer, okay? What you need to do is this. So we're gonna go ahead and leave this window open, and now we're gonna go back to the My Files here, and we're gonna go ahead and, what you have to do here is you're gonna have to go ahead and use two fingers and click it. Okay, use two fingers, click it, and this menu will pop up, and then we want to go to New Window. Now, this new window here will pop up. Now, if we take a look at this right here, now the thing is, we have to click on Downloads, okay? So if we click on Downloads, now this is actual um, stuff that's actually on my hard drive. Let me delete this. So I'm on Downloads folder right now. Now I can go ahead and drag and drop. I can go ahead and drag and drop this video. I can go directly into the uh, downloads folder, and now um, this is saved to my hard drive, okay? But what I typically do is I go ahead and click on the uh, downloads, and then I double tap my uh, mouse pad, and I go to new folder, and then I name this something. Let's just say photos. And now I have a folder under the downloads folder, so I can double click on that. Now I can choose whatever I want, put everything into a folder. For example, I drag and drop all of those. Now all three of these uh, files are going to be saved into that, uh, that folder called Photos that's under Downloads. So you can go ahead and see here the uh, two MP4s and the JPEG right there. So there you go. So now this is actually on my actual hard drive of my Chromebook. So there you guys go. Pretty simple. Any questions or issues? Just go ahead and comment below and I'll try to help you guys out. Okay, see you guys.